Hello and welcome back to the channel for another video. No face cam for this one. This is one of the posts that we're going to go over, but I just want to quickly talk about how I kind of got here. So I check Reddit usually. I spoke about it in my last podcast. It'll be linked in the description and on the end screen of this video. But I usually go to Reddit and I usually look at like YouTube drama. And so like I go here and I'm like, okay, well, I've never watched a Gabby Hanna video. I've never seen a Trisha Paytas video. So I have no interest in covering something like this. And then I don't know who, what T is. And I've never watched a Freely video and so on and so forth. And then something I also check is the Creep Show Art subreddit because I post it in there uh, once or twice. And because I've made videos about it, it's nice to kind of keep up. So... I came across this, Odessa Gorn again, and I was like, what? And then if you scroll down a little bit more, there's this, Odessa is back, which I haven't watched or anything, but it seems like this doesn't exist anymore. But basically, Odessa was back. I guess we should start here and say, at the beginning of this podcast, my partner doesn't even know if Odessa thought it was Shannon. And thought she was back. Well, I can tell this, yeah, this doesn't exist. So, what's interesting though is that I believe this is the same URL that they used to be. There's still no post on Vimeo, by the way. Uh, also, the thing, the picture, I think has changed to this uh, squid, I believe it is. I was trying to access it via Pocket Cast, but it seems that like. It kind of isn't accessible. I haven't heard it. Uh, I think here there should be a bit of a, a bit of information. I'm just going to read it. I haven't heard it. But if you did and if you did know, let me know in the comment section below. I'm happy to have a discussion about it. But this is what the comments say. There's 46 comments, so I won't read through all of them. The top one says, if she's not Shannon Wise, Odessa obsessing with white knighting her. That's what I'd like to know. Why can't you just move on? And why is she so bothered with the accusation that she's shattered? Most people would just be like, I'm not her, haha, ha, you can think that, I guess, and then move on with content. I'm about halfway through, and the only point she's made is, I'm not shattered. That's interesting. That implies that it's much the same. It's all she's got other than preaching and while grandstanding. It reminds me of when Cringy was accused of being disassociated. Is that how you pronounce it? I have no idea who they are. Cringy just said that she wasn't blah 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 and kept it moving because she is actually a different person. Exactly why I even bother? You'd think that Shane would be smart enough to know that doing this entire thing and getting really bothered by people accusing her of being Shane only brings more attention to herself and makes her look more suspicious. You can, you can say that, but all this is doing, even this video, is bringing more attention to Creep Show Art. Now, there's a good chance that maybe some people who've never heard of Creepshow Art have seen this video and will therefore go and check and because she's not demonetized, she will potentially make a couple of cents out of it. And then if more people make videos, then they're essentially fueling uh, the existence of her channel and therefore she is technically profiting off it. Uh, there is something here about not profiting off it. Is there any chance that this is just a troll now trying to profit off the situation. See, that's the thing. This could be a troll who enjoys fucking with people and getting a rise out of the internet, but there's no profit. See? But technically, if it is Shannon, which it is 100% confirmed, and I'm not going to go out on limb and say that it is, then she's technically. Someone said, by the way, people uh, need it. I have archived the episodes. So there is archives. Interesting. Apparently it's all on Breaker. Okay, so I think all the old episodes are on here. Yep, so that's interesting. So all the old episodes are on Breaker. There you go. There'll be a link to that in the description if you want to listen to the old ones. I don't know where the new one can be heard. Yeah, it seems like people are still saying that it's Shannon, which is understandable because people want to believe that, and I 
have said. I think that I'm not 100% sure. Uh, I also stated that I had never seen a Creepshow art video, which some people found strange. But my whole thing is not to say that this is Shannon. My whole thing is to present the information for you to make up your own mind. This episode was called Hater Nation, as you can see from the URL. I wonder if it was saved to the Wayback Machine. That's interesting. People are catching on. It's saved to the Wayback Machine. I doubt I'll be able to listen to it, but it's interesting that it is being saved. While that loads, uh, let's talk about this post from a day ago. It says, honestly, I'm almost over following this or considering taking a break, lol, but I did notice today the podcast could, can't be found on Anchor again. I was curious if it's just on my side or if she really deleted it again. It's just really mind-boggling. Someone says, if true, I'd say it increases the odds that she's Shannon. Her next move would be to put on a different pair of grouchy glasses and come back as one more, just an observer. So yeah, I guess that's kind of where we stand for now. It's still post... Most days on here, there's something about, there's discussions about things, there's timelines and allegations. If you're curious, if you want to talk about it or keep up to date or whatever, there's, there's a whole bunch of stuff, really, like, if you, yeah, if you're curious. I think that this is the same URL, which, if it is, is interesting, because that may actually play into the whole she was hacked thing because she said that she was hacked and that that was Amy or allegedly she was saying that it was Amy because that was how it kind of happened There's, there is a new thing was saved to the Wayback Machine uh, I don't think if you click on this you can't listen to it I don't think it's called Hater Nation 01 that uh, goes for five minutes. That's all I can really tell you. I don't know what is and isn't saved. But yeah, thanks for watching this video. There will be a thing on the end screen to a podcast I put out the other day, which talks a little bit about this and generally how I find my videos and kind of a rundown of the even our rabbit hole and just a whole bunch of stuff if you're interested. It's mainly for new people. Uh, and also people who are just interested in my research process and how I find things and stuff. But yeah. Have a nice day and thanks for watching. Hopefully you'll see the newish background in the next video. But I'm hoping that the next video won't be about this because I'd love to move past it. But this is something that I've been following and the people who seem to be interested in. So yeah. I have spoken previously in the comments about feeling kind of obligated about keeping up with this because people are interested and it's how a whole bunch of people found my channel. So, yeah. But yeah. Thanks for watching.